girl went back to Napoli because she missed the scenery, the native dances and the charming songs. But wait a minute, something's wrong. Mambo Italiano, eh, hey, Mambo, Mambo Italiano, go, go, go. You mixed up Sigiliano, all you Calabrese do the Mambo like a crazy weather. Good morning, vlog. Let me take it in. Jake, what are you making? Potatoes. Tomatoes? And say what's up to the vlog. What up? Today is Saturday, and I think you're pretty familiar with my vlogs, so I made a part two of it. And first, we just have to cut, but I didn't get the pre stuff before, so you have to like wash the jars and then put them in the dishwasher and then carry them out and all that good stuff. But the first step is obviously we have to cut them. So it's about 9 30, and I got my orange juice. And we're just gonna go cut some tomatoes. Say boo. Boo. Juby. Hey, Grandma. Yeah, honey. Show the camera how you cut a tomato the right way. <laughs> you cut it and then you take the green out. Slice so that it's easier to boil. Take the green out because that's the bitter part. And then you slice it and that gets boiled. And you put it in there and that gets boiled, right? That gets boiled in the pots over there. The first boil. Look how fast you cut tomatoes. I already did a whole thing. I already did all that. You know that? Estina, show how you cut a tomato. No, I'm better this year. I always do it like that. I am better this year. Show how you cut a tomato. One. Oh, this one has a little rotten to it. You said that. You told me. Yeah. Gee, Mom, a little slow, you said. Mom, I'm going to keep them, but I don't. Oh, yeah, you did say that, too. Take this piece out. Look. And the four. That's right. An hour, and I did one. Grandpa, you want to say hi? Hi. Oh, wait, right? A little bit. This is where the cut tomatoes get put and they get boiled. Yeah, three days. She's been here two weeks. Tomatoes. Two weeks, two weeks. All cut. Yeah, it's a I'll show you a little like setup of like what's going on back here. So we got the boiling station where everything gets boiled. Right here. This is where the stations get washed. Every crate is called a bushel, and I think they already cut up about two or three. They're the empty crates. So they go through um, first wash, then second wash, and then third wash. So those need to get cleaned. These are where all the rotten tomatoes go. Um, same with those. Oh, Ange, when you're ready, this is Ange. You know him. He's my bro. Yeah, you can't eat you know, tomatoes. But he's going to show you how to roll. professionally wash uh, a tomato after. Okay. And our secret code for a rotten tomato. So this is where the boiled tomatoes get put into this machine and they come out and they turn into sauce and they get boiled one last time. So here's the machine we got going on here. Oh, beautiful scenery and it's raining. If your hands are dirty, you just wash them in the sink. And here's our cutting station. And tomato sauce? No. What? What are you cleaning? Uh, uh, uh. Oh, you're cleaning? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. What's up, Ange? Welcome. So this is your station. My corner. Uh, what goes on here? I wash. Tell the camera a little bit about this part. I take a bushel. I put it in bucket one. Where's bucket? Wait, you gotta like... This is bucket one. Oh, okay. Then I take uh, whatever's nasty and I throw it in the trash bin. Then I take whatever is not too nasty and I throw it in the pail. And then whatever is just the right amount of not nasty, I put in bucket number two. And then it makes its way all the way down. And, and what bucket I, is this? This is bucket number three. This is like, if you made it here, you're a, you're a good one. You know what I mean? So let's go check out the sauce. She works in a Brazilian hospital. Wow. 
Wow, look at that color. Right. They should have been right right now. The right the good farms have nice red tomatoes. Alright, this is how I cut a tomato. Like that. Then you cut this in half. Cut the top. Go back in half. Cut the top. Not getting stuck, right? Go back in half. No burning. The key to cutting tomatoes is quickness. It's a nice. Okay, so you guys know I like talking. Um, I just decided to come in and there's no one in here, so I'm just gonna make a bagel. And they're still cutting and you know, blah, blah, blah. But um, basically, I guess, if you don't really know what's going on, I'll just fill you in on the rundown. So right now it's like 10.30 and we're still cutting and there's about six more bushels to be cut. It's a lot of work, but at the end of the day, you get a nice bowl of pasta with a lot of sauce and you get to taste your Effort, I guess. I don't even know what I'm saying. I don't know. I think I'm like one of the few people that actually like likes this day. Like the work is a lot, yes, but um, but it's fun. Um, it's just like really like tradition, and I love anything tradition related and just keeping a story going. You kind of just go in and eat whenever you want. There's not really a set time where we'll take a break because then nothing would get done. So, um, right now they're still cutting and they're still washing and they're still boiling and cooking. And yeah, so I'm making a bagel. And then this is usually breakfast and then this is usually lunch at about like one o'clock. Then dinner. Last, no, two years ago, we do this every two, well, we used to do this every year, but now we do it every two years because we actually make enough sauce for two years. Um, two years ago, we got pizza, but usually we just make pasta and stuff and eat the sauce but um yeah i just i wanted to make a new tomato sauce video because i feel like the one from two years ago was like outdated and like i don't know i was really cringy in it and i'm not saying i'm not cringy in this now because i hella am um you're supposed to dress in like really like not gross but like clothes that you don't mind like getting like dirty or whatever because you just get full of tomato and it's a good idea to wear like longer pants like sweats or something because when you're um, doing the machine tomato sauce gets like squirted like everywhere and it's literally like straight like from boiling so it's boiling like tomato sauce and it burns like hell and you can get out of here with burns and scratches and scrapes and I'm already like kind of covered in like sauce and I've only been cutting for like an hour I just hope that one day like I'll look back at this video and be like thank god like I made it no, 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 you can't work. Okay, yeah, really stand there and then I help you. Yeah. We'll go past it now. Use the pasta. Look through the machine. Just take away the garbage. There's gonna be no sound. Porte casuna con un stemma a rete Una cupulella che vi si era aizzata Passa scampagnando pattuleta Con mano a papà te fa guardà Tu fa l'americano, americano, americano Sienta a me chi tu fa fa Tu vuoi vivere alla moda ma se bevi whisky e soda, poi tu siente disturbato. Tu a ballo rock and roll, tu gioca a baseball, fai sorte per camella, chi te li dà la borsetta di mamma, tu vuoi fare l'americano, americano, americano. Ma se nati in Italia, siente a me non c'è sta niente a fare. Ok, Napolita, tu vuoi fare l'americano, tu vuoi fare l'americano. Oh my God, I got a blister from cutting. <laughs> How long have you been cutting for? It's been 7 o'clock this morning, 7.30, right? And it's now 11 o'clock, so how long am I cutting? Four hours. We're doing four bushels, and we're still not finished. Ten bushels, we're still not finished. Got it. three more to go there. Anything else you want to say? No. <laughs> Hi.
It was different. It's not like today where you come. We used to put in whole, whole tomatoes and put them in the bottles and the bottles will get boiled. That's how we did it. Then when I came to this country, we started growing up and that's when we started making tomatoes in our home. So what? I have to get, I have to get And we all milk? cut, we clean, we pick up sure jars, so. who cleans? We, we all work together milk? as a family. Now, we always work together as a family. Now what happened is we all have our own family, so we do it ourselves. So ma'am, why do you make your own tomato sauce? Because it tastes better than the stores. It's more preserved, there's no preservative, there's nothing, everything is fresh. Why don't you try to sell your tomato sauce? It's priceless. We could not put a price on it. And if we do put a price, it's too expensive, but look at all the work that we do. Um, the last question, is tradition important to you? Yes, very important for me and for my grandchildren. And my children and my grandchildren to believe and to have. It's something that I want to leave from my European country. Okay, say goodbye in Italian. Arrivederci, grazie, ciao. That's good, Brianna? It wow, such point. interview questions. Um, my grandmother is not here with us, and she used to have the most wonderful stories, and I never recorded her because we didn't have the technology, and I want to make sure you have your grandmother. Right. Does this get any more Italian? Yeah. Like, really? Grandma, say cheese. Cheese. Hey, Pa. This one was been... You guys. You got a 23.19, yo. This one's, this one's been Thank through hell and back. We need tomatoes here. I'm pretty sure you made that same too. What? We need tomatoes. Into a little. I got you. But it wash faster, honey. Grandpa, what are you doing? <laughs> I'm still a tomato. Cook tomatoes. Already cut it. Okay. Wow. Hey, what you got that apron for? The kitchen. Okay, there's so many. You should have got me a smaller one. This is too big. Really? <laughs> I don't get it. Is it too small? No, I wanted a bigger spoon. Oh. What are you doing? I want to make sure I put enough salt. Enough, enough. Don't go. We never tested on it. No, I didn't. A little bit more. I'm not going to what? Salty? Yeah, that's it. You like salt. Looks good, doesn't it? Stir it good. Stir it, stir it, honey, this way. Brianna, the basil. Go get the basil. Anything empty somewhere? Okay, I was busy here, so. What? We still cut in. Oh, wow. how many bushels we have left? One. <laughs> One <laughs> bushel. Look, I'm literally destroyed. And I'm itchy everywhere. Are you itchy yet? No. I'm itchy everywhere. You might be allergic to tomatoes. I hate tomatoes. I like tomato sauce, but I literally despise tomatoes. They're disgusting. Yeah. Okay, Grandma. It's really just like a repetitive process. That's why I'm not like showing you the video over and over and over again because it's just repetitive. It's just keep cutting and keep boiling and keep passing and keep jarring and keep cutting and keep boiling and keep passing and keep jarring. It's the same thing over and over again. Are you the fastest cutter, Grandma, in the world? No, honey. Uh, they think they're gonna beat me and Grandma. Are you kidding me? Are you guys? Do you guys think you're gonna beat Grandma and Brianna? Yep. Yeah? <laughs> yeah? So far it's this to this. Who will win? Yeah, 
video the How cutting. How far is there? So yeah, who's this higher? I don't know yet. Yeah. I... That bush will really. Come on, Brianna, hurry up! Did because it makes me nervous. You gotta go, go faster. The way I am cutting, I am like world class. To be done I'm taking my lunch break now. I a bomb ass sandwich, and um, they're still cutting. And turns out we had ten bushels. And I showed you before a bushel is one of those crates. And um, they thought it wasn't enough, so we we had to go back out and buy three more bushels. So we have to wash those and cut them. So right now we're just waiting for the bushels to come because we got three more. And then we have to cut those. Um, does anyone have the time? Oh, so there's a clock on the garage. It's about two o'clock. Oh, Grandpa, look at that sandwich. Nice. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> there it is. Three more bushels. Yeah, you can like three weeks ago. Good. These are all good. Oh, My grandma never gets tired. Lights it up. And she still is going. I can't, I can't help it. Let's show the Hallelujah. La chate mi cantare, te viene solo un quiero, solo mi italiano, mi italiano vero. So, they're still cutting, but <laughs> we're making pizzas. Sauce. Wow. I'm not good at this. I so. <laughs> don't want any experts watching me and judging me. Got the mozzarella. Got the pounds. I love not cutting tomatoes. It's like at this point it should be over. <laughs> Gotta make the holes in the pizza so the air can breathe through. Yeah. Hi, Grandpa. I need you to, to clean the pots. So, it's that time. I have to wash. Unfortunately, and usually for some reason it's me and Grandma can you untie this apron? Or do you have fingers? 20. Grandma caught herself really badly. This is how much tomatoes left to cut. That's it. That is it. And we done. Let's see the time is 430 All right, so now it's time to wash So look at all this stuff I have to clean. I mean I'm not complaining but like I have to go pee really bad it's You're watching the pizza cook? Watch the pizza. So take a break. Oh, wow. Is it not mesmerizing? It is. It's pretty cool. Finish. Clean. And all that stuff is so dirty. Chemalo <laughs> Wee gumba, no kalamara, jajakata. 
And now for you nice ladies and gentlemen out there who don't understand the Italian language. Lazy Mary, you better get up. She answered back, I am not evil. Lazy Mary, you better get up. We need the sheets for the table. Me. Look what I have to wash. Pots. I'm like crying on the inside. Smell the dry, you can smell it, and you can smell it. What kind of smell? Yeah, yeah, yeah. She used to do that. Yeah. <laughs> video me. I love it. You're in, you're in. Yes, yes. Oh, it's it's Pasta. Your shirt. <laughs> so they tell me your shirt. <laughs> and my granddaughter, huh? My granddaughter. I got your pizzas on tape. Whoa. Look at Angelo. Conk. Out. Everything is. Finito. So grandma's got her looking for wine. So we're gonna go see if we can find some wine in the garage. Maybe this one, maybe. I didn't know. Alexa, play Europe 72. Year of 72 by Grateful Dead from Spotify. Found this. I found this. Is anybody this? I don't know. You're the pizza person now? Via, via. Vieni via di qui. Niente più ti lega questi luoghi. Neanche questi fiori azzurri. Via, via. Neanche questo tempo grigio, pieno di musiche e di uomini che ti sono piaciuti. It's wonderful, it's wonderful, it's wonderful, good luck my baby, it's wonderful, it's wonderful, it's wonderful, I dream of you. Chips, chips, do 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 do, do 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 do, do 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 do, do 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 do. Yeah, that's it. Finished, finally. And now we eat. Now we eat the sauce. Via, via. Vieni via con me. Entra in questo amore buio. Non perderti per niente al mondo. Via, via. So we made 232 jars. And split it up between all of us. Grandma gets, Grandma, how many jars do you get? 162 jars. So, guess we're gonna have to make more next Look at my baby, that's wonderful, that's wonderful, that's wonderful, I dream of 